It's always gonna be me. Part twice, never nice. Yeah, I say what I say when I say what I say. I say it again like I said it then. You know what I'm saying, my guy? You know what I'm saying? You put this motherfucker shit in your life, man. You ain't heard no shit like this yet. I got the right to defend myself from all evil. Got you mad cause I fucked your bitch up all people. She belong to the streets, so don't get mad at me. I'm letting go to the Get you the R.I.P. It's real in these streets. Sometimes you gotta kill him. You can find another bitch. Fuck her and that nigga. Move on to the other side of town. Pretty fine brown, red bone. Brother's a friend. I roll the window down. Get in, girl. The AC ice cold. Put the pimpin' on display. Pinky ring. Rivers gang jumped in the car. Mama told me that I smell good. I asked her good enough to eat. That kind of smell good. She said, Yes, you know what's next. And I ain't wanna have sex. I just won't go for they next. I ain't wanna have sex. I just won't go for they next. Yes sir, yes sir. Look here, I'm gonna be straight up with you. Black on black boxing is not a pay per view type of fight. We always see black on black crime every day. You can look on Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, and you can see some black on black crime every day. You gonna always see black on black violence. We are desensitized. Now. What is going to sell is the black on brown and the black on white. If that was a bunch of niggas that jumped that man at that boat, when nobody would have jumped in that water and when there been no type of rise going on, there would have been a whole bunch of videos and niggas laughing at motherfuckers getting beat up. They would have broke the fight up, but it wouldn't have been no big spectacle. But the fact that it was a whole bunch of white boys that jumped that boy, that, that's what got everybody riled up. So that's what it is, folks. Ever since Jack Johnson, they have always been looking for the great white hype. You have the movie, Sylvester Stallone is in the Boxing Hall of Fame, but never boxed a day in his life. But yet and still, it's an image of a black man getting beaten by a Italian stallion. Yet and still, he takes million punches to the face, but never goes down. A true warrior. Well, these fighters are imaginary and fairy tale, and in real life, these fighters are struggling to get a shot at the title. Now, when you say belts don't matter, you can never say that because back then belts mattered because that's how you got the paydays. And if you had to fight a Mexican or White boy to get it, you had to do what you had to do. Black on black boxing will not sell. So Shakur, Devin Haney, you will not get a fight with Tank Davis because that will not sell. They will always be looking for the great white hope. Tyson Fury is a drug cheat and he's a well-known glove manipulator. You can say the referee Jack Reese is a good referee because he lets the guys fight. But if a man's eyes roll back in the back of his head, he's out of there. Now you got in your way. He's tearing shit up back in the light divisions. Real little bitty niggas. He took out Cool Boy. Cool Boy Stephen Fulton. Yes, they love him. They say he's number one pound for pound now. But wait a minute, they want him to come all the way up and fight Tank. Why? Because he's their dream to beat the big black monkey. It's okay, they don't care about the niggas beating Tank. But if Inuwe could beat Tank, oh my God. Godzilla versus King Kong. That's the image that the European eye wants to see. Canelo Alvarez, all of these guys, they are considered a European standard. Devin Haney, 
going to Australia two times to get pimped by Cambosis. It was a challenge, whether he beat Cambosis easily or not because the scorecards were already rigged. But he had no choice to give him the unanimous decision because guess what? If it would have been a close fight, ooh wee, they would have gave it to Boses. Charlo out of there. Boo Boo out of there. Hey Crawford, you really wanna go up there and fuck with Canelo? The Mr. Clinton Buterol King? I don't know. You got superior skills though. Maybe you can work your will like Charlo and throw some punches in between. I'm just trying to keep it real because you definitely don't want to fuck with Jerron Ennis. That would definitely get you a X on your face. Maybe, maybe not. Prove me wrong. Bust my lip. Make it look like I got Kool-Aid in my mouth. It's just all perception. It's all what it seems. Lomachenko got a fight, a championship fight, his second fight in, oh, I guess because he's an Olympian, right? No, that's not why. Hey, Bob, that's your guy. And I know you're going to keep him in the mix. But we know why. Do I have to say it again? My friend, they're looking for the great white hope. The revolution would not be televised because they get guys like me off the air. I'm not as big as Farrakhan and Riza Islam, but that's my mind state. Hey, Charlo, you let us down. You heard them singing in the locker room. You didn't, they didn't sing that song coming out the tunnel. Got the negra. I see you.